Hey guys, it's Joanna here. Some of you have requested a video on my healthy bread recipe. April the 25th is also known as Zucchini Bread Day. And so I am going to share with you my healthy and delicious zucchini bread. The typical zucchini bread calls for a lot of added sugar and oil. For my recipe, we will be replacing it with banana and honey. And instead of using white or whole wheat flour, I'll be using a combination of rye and oat flour. Of course, you may still use whole wheat flour. However, it is worth noting that rye contains higher fiber in comparison to whole wheat. And rye keeps you satisfied for much longer because the fiber in rye bread has a high water binding capacity which expands during digestion and produces a great feeling of fullness. Rye is also low in glycemic index and rye bread is recommended for a healthy weight maintenance and also weight loss. To make my healthy and delicious zucchini bread, the ingredients you'll need are one and a half cups of rye flour, half cup of oat flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, one and a half cups of zucchini shredded, which also equals to one and a half medium zucchinis, two tablespoons of honey, two eggs, quarter cup of milk, one large banana mashed, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and half a teaspoon of mixed herbs or cinnamon or nutmeg. The first step is to preheat the oven to 180 degrees Celsius or 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Start by shredding the zucchinis with a grater or food processor, just like what I'm doing. In one bowl, combine all the dry ingredients, rye flour, oat flour, baking powder and mixed herbs. In another bowl, mash the banana, whisk in the eggs, then add the milk, honey, and vanilla extract. Mix them well. Then combine the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients. Finally, add in the shredded zucchini and continue mixing until you have a thick and moist batter. Grease one loaf pan with cooking spray. Pour the batter into the loaf pan and make sure it is level in the pan. Then bake it in the oven for 50 to 60 minutes or until a toothpick inserted in the center comes out clean. Allow the zucchini bread to cool down for 15 minutes before removing from pan. Then cool it down again for another 15 minutes before slicing. Your zucchini bread should be slightly moist. Each loaf makes about 14 slices and each slice has 86 calories. It is delicious on its own or you can spread some jam or peanut butter or top it up with poached egg. I like to have two slices for breakfast, one with jam and another with poached egg. This bread is so healthy, packed full of fiber from the oats, rye and zucchini. It has no added sugar and no added oil, hence being low in calories as well. It is a great way to pack more vegetables from the zucchini, fruit from the banana, complex carbs from the rye and oats and protein from the eggs. I would definitely suggest this for breakfast to boost your metabolism, boost your energy and to curb hunger. Try it out, make it on Zucchini Bread Day and share your picture with me on Facebook or Instagram. For new fitness, food and motivational videos, please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel and website. Do follow me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter to stay connected with me. Thanks guys!